Jack Vance's The Dying Earth is a seminal work in the genre of science fantasy, presenting a vividly imaginative and decaying world. Set in a far future Earth, where the sun is a red, waning orb and the world is on the brink of ultimate entropy, the novel presents a tapestry of strange and evocative landscapes populated by bizarre characters and arcane mysteries. The setting of the novel is crucial to its atmosphere. Vance creates a world that feels both alien and intimately familiar, where the last remnants of humanity grapple with a dying planet. The sun's dim light casts an eerie glow over a landscape of forgotten cities and crumbling ruins. The pervasive sense of decay and decline is not just physical but also cultural, reflecting a civilization in its final twilight. This setting is not merely a backdrop but an integral part of the narrative, shaping the story and its characters in profound ways. The characters in The Dying Earth are emblematic of Vance's unique style. They are often self-serving and morally ambiguous, operating within a world where traditional ethical norms have long since eroded. Vance's protagonists are typically antiheroes, driven by personal desires and survival instincts rather than grand ideals. Their quests, while seemingly mundane or self-centered, are imbued with a sense of existential significance. Through their actions and motivations, Vance explores themes of power, ambition, and the search for meaning in a world that has lost its direction. The narrative structure of The Dying Earth is episodic, composed of a series of interconnected stories rather than a single, continuous plot. This format allows Vance to delve into various facets of his world, presenting a rich array of characters and situations. Each story is a vignette that contributes to the overall tapestry of the novel, offering glimpses into the diverse and often surreal aspects of the dying world. This episodic approach enhances the sense of mystery and wonder, as each tale reveals new facets of the setting and its inhabitants. One of the central themes of the novel is the passage of time and the inevitability of decline. Vance's depiction of a dying earth serves as a metaphor for the impermanence of civilizations and the transient nature of existence. The characters' quests often revolve around the pursuit of lost knowledge or magical artifacts, reflecting a deep yearning to understand and perhaps reverse the decay that envelopes their world. This theme is poignantly illustrated through the various magical and technological remnants scattered across the landscape, symbols of a once great civilization now in ruin. Magic and technology in The Dying Earth are intertwined, creating a unique blend of science fantasy. Vance's world is rich with ancient, often enigmatic artifacts that hold the key to understanding the past and perhaps influencing the future. These artifacts are not merely plot devices but integral elements of the world's mythology, embodying the remnants of lost knowledge and power. The interplay between magic and technology highlights the novel's exploration of human ambition and the limits of understanding in the face of cosmic indifference. Vance's prose is characterized by its lyrical and descriptive quality, immersing readers in the novel's fantastical world. His use of language is both evocative and precise, capturing the essence of the dying earth and the strange, often unsettling experiences of its inhabitants. The novel's tone is one of melancholy and wonder, reflecting the profound sense of loss and the lingering hope for redemption or understanding in a world that seems to be slipping into oblivion. In summary, The Dying Earth is a masterful exploration of a world in decline, blending vivid world-building with deep thematic concerns. Vance's portrayal of a dying civilization and its enigmatic inhabitants invites readers to reflect on the nature of existence, the passage of time, and the quest for meaning in an increasingly uncertain world. Through its episodic structure, richly detailed setting, and complex characters, the novel stands as a landmark in science fantasy, offering a timeless meditation on the end of things and the enduring quest for knowledge and significance.